In this video, we will show you how to simply and successfully assemble Tensility's push-pull locking connector. The materials you will need are a push-pull locking connector that includes an outer shell, slit insert carriers, an internal connector, a collet and collet nut, soldering equipment, and wire. Strip 10 millimeters off the blunt end of the outer jacket and remove the shield if applicable. Try not to strip more than 13 millimeters. Strip off four millimeters from all insulators. If you are using a drain wire, apply heat shrink to the drain, leaving four millimeters of the conductor exposed. Thread the collet nut onto the wire, tapered end first. Feed the collet onto the wire, multi-split side first. Solder the conductors to their respective cups. Note that the red circled cup is pin one, then follow the red line for pins two, three, and four. If you are using the shield or drain as the fourth conductor, be sure to apply heat shrink around the outer jacket of the wire. Place the keyed carrier insert onto the insulator. They should key together, but shouldn't cover the pins. Line up the lower insert carrier to create a complete shell. Feed the inner connector into the outer shell with the key and red dot in alignment. Slide the collet into the outer shell. Make sure the key is aligned with the red dot. Screw on the collet nut, but do not over tighten. If you experience resistance when tightening the nut, don't force it. Make sure all the various keys are aligned and then try screwing the nut back on. Tensility's push-pull locking connector is available with four to seven pins. If you have questions about the right configuration for your application, our engineers are here to help. Tensility is a worldwide provider of basic and customizable connectors, cables, and wire for use in cutting edge industries and entrepreneurial ventures. Call or email us today.